What's up guys, in this video I'll be teaching you how to fix these 1600 errors on your iDevice. Uh, you get this error when restoring your device or downgrading whatever process of it is. But uh, you get it when restoring. So I'm going to be demonstrating this on my iPod Touch 4th generation. As you see, um, this is the 4th generation iPod Touch. This does work with any iDevice. All you will need to do is go to the link below in my video description, click on it, and make sure you download iReb. And uh, let's begin. So once you have it extracted to your desktop, go ahead and plug in your device. So let me go ahead and plug in mine. Alright, once it's fully connected and you see that it lights up, right click on iReb, hit run as administrator, hit yes. And this is iReb right here. All you want to do is choose your device. So I do have the iPod Touch 4. And we're going to be putting it into DFU mode. You do not need to turn it off to put it into DFU mode. You just follow my instructions. So just click on your device and it will automatically grant you with directions to put your device into DFU mode. So let's begin. Power and home together for 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Release the power button. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, and it should say exploiting with Lime Rain, and it's going to put your device in a Pwn DFU state. That's basically what we want to fix the 1600 error, and once it's done, you can go ahead and open up iTunes. And it'll tell you your device is in a recovery mode, hit OK. And all you want to do is just shift click restore to the firmware that you want to restore or downgrade to. And that's basically it guys. So once you restore to the firmware, this error will no longer be there. Um, so yeah, please be sure to rate, comment, and subscribe. Um, like this video if it helped you. And subscribe to my YouTube channel to be updated with more news. Peace.